Hey guys, it's me again. Sorry that I've been gone for a few weeks. Um, I've had some things to take care of, but I am back now. Uh, I got a new Blu-ray 4K unboxing, but before I get to that unboxing, I kind of just want to do a quick video on something about comments that I have gotten in the past. Um, I'm not going to say names. I'm just going to say that I want to give these digital copies out to people. Um, it's just sometimes it's very difficult to choose which one gets what because um, there's so many people and the comments I've gotten saying that I've just I'm using digital copies just to get subscribers and never give it to people that is not true um, it's just like I said it's hard to choose for choose people who I give this to because I want everyone to get one I can't just give a digital copy to the same people every single time or there'll be no point of doing this because I want everyone to get a copy so unfortunately, there's going to be some people that don't get it, and I'm sorry about that, but I mean, these movies only come with one digital copy, so I'm not trying to I'm not trying to do a rant or anything, or well, I kind of am, but I just want to say that, unfortunately, I can't give this digital copy to everybody, and if I don't give it out right away, it's not that I'm just using these things just to get subscribers, that's not true. I have to decide who I want to give this to. Um, so I still have... Um, a digital copy for American Cycle that I have not given out yet, which I do want to give to somebody, and I'll have a new one for the film about to show you guys to unbox. Um, so yeah, I just want people to know that I'm not just screwing people over. I'm. It just takes a while to choose who these are, are going to give to. So enough of that rant. So today I have a new unboxing for Sicario, the day of the Sedado, whatever the hell that was called. I can't read it today. Um, I know I'm a little late on this, um, but this there's no digital, co there's no, um, there's no slip cover on this. I just got this like this. Um, that's probably a good thing because I, I know this is gonna piss some people off, but I have kind of thrown all my slip covers away. I'm very picky about um, how my movies look on my shelf. I kind of want it just the way it is. I'll show you guys. You can see it's just it's just all flat as much as possible, which I like the most. As you can see, they're all flat. I don't. I think with slip covers, it kind of it throws them off, and I don't like that. So I have now decided to get rid of slip covers because I've always had years of slip cover annoyance. As you can see, I'm kind of running out of space. Got the same thing for those. So yeah. <sighs> so yeah, I so as I said, no foot cover for this, but I really like the cover for it. This one's got Benicio del Toro and Josh Brolin. Josh Brolin, I might have to say, is having a freaking year this year with Avengers in May and Deadpool in May, and then this movie th this last June. He's definitely had a very good role. I can't, or a very good year. I can't wait to see what he does with Thanos next year for Avengers Four. So yeah, it's a little disappointing. The director, of the first one, Denise, I really can't pronounce his last name, didn't come back, and um, Emily Blunt didn't come back. Uh, I liked her character in the first one. It was very fun with her. She was definitely a badass chick. But I'm still really looking forward to this one. I definitely do like those two actors very much. So yeah. Um, so like I said, here's this with no slip cover. Here's the spine, and here's the back. Um, all right. Well, hopefully this come up easily. Hopefully this does come with a digital copy. Um, yeah, I freaking hate this. Uh, oh, there we go. Yeah. So yeah, I am. Um, like I said, I've been gone for a while, but I'm coming back now. I am still doing, trying to do movie reviews. I'm definitely seeing Halloween, the remake, or not remake, but the continuation this weekend. So definitely look forward to that review, hopefully Friday night. Uh, I definitely can't wait to see that. Oh, that was easy. So yeah, here's the front, here's the spine, and here's the back.
As usual, being at Sony, there's going to be no disc art. Well, there is, but it's just the 4K disc and the Blu-ray disc. Nothing too special. I feel like this is a little pricey. I mean, this is almost $30, but, you know, if you want the 4K, you got to pay for it. So, yeah, there is the unboxing of Sicario. I definitely can't wait to give this a try and compare it to the first one. And if you guys want me to do reviews on these films, let me know in the comments. Um, I definitely would like to do more of these videos. So yeah, there is that unboxing, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. And like I said, I will be back this weekend for the review of Halloween, which I cannot wait to see. Um, I, In a way, I'm kind of happy that it's erasing all the films after the first one, so it's a direct sequel to the first one four years later. I feel like that's the best choice they could go with it. So, hope you guys enjoy this videos, and I will see you this weekend with Halloween 2018.